Today, we are very happy to share really good HIHO news. We have published the first ever chromosome length genome of the helmeted hand eater and its high density linkage map. But what are those? When we talk about chromosome link genome, we mean that we have all the genetic information of the helmeted hand eater assembled in sequences that are so long and complete that some of them represent full chromosomes. And the high density linkage map means that for more than 50,000 little bits around the chromosome, we know how often they are inherited together from parent to offspring. Building these two resources for any organism is really difficult. In fact, to date, only a handful of birds have them both. Building them for the HIHO required super hard work done for decades and the collaboration of multiple institutions, such as DELP, Paris Victoria, SUS Victoria, Friends of the Helmeted Honey Eater, Monash University, Deakin University, DNA Zoo, Max Planck Institute, among many others. Thanks to this massive effort, now the critically endangered HIHO has entered the club of the VIBs. So, what does this mean for the conservation of the helmeted honey eater? It means that we are now optimally equipped to study the genetic rescue of the population. That with the genome and linkage map, we will be able to identify the genetic distinctiveness of the HIHO, so that we can preserve this HIHO-ness during genetic rescue. In the end, genetic rescue will restore the genetic health of the HIHO population so that it can grow and thrive again.